welcome to my channel i am dr k p <coughs> naidu in this lecture i am going to discuss about two more important concepts of support vector machine that is hard margin and soft margin margin we are having two types of margins one thing is called as hard margin and the type is called as the soft margin guys you can easily understand these two concepts okay in some interviews they are asking different types of margins these are the simplest concepts okay what is meant by hard margin and what is meant by soft margin simply we remember hard margin means if you can correctly classify the data points if you correctly classify the data points okay then that is we are called as the hard margin with, with the help of the with the help of the hyperplane if you are correctly classify both classes it may be blue class or it may be here a green class if you correctly classify okay if you correctly classify both classes with the help of the hyperplane that hyperplane or that margin we are called as the hard margin okay for example these are the blue class points these are the some orange uh, sorry green, uh, green class points for example in this we are having one more for example some what is called as blue co blue color blue color point let us assume okay let us assume in this we are having some blue class point okay so is it possible to correctly classify is it possible to correctly classify the blue class and uh, what is called as a green class no why because from this margin okay above we are having the blue class in below we are having the both green class and blue class it's not correctly classified okay at that time hard margin does not works hard margin does not works the hard margin works only for linearly separable data only linearly separable data only that means that means if you are finding the margin you finding the margin okay that margin one side points must be a one class the another side must be a another class only it does not accept the mixed class points in some any other side okay what we conclude from that it assumes that data is perfectly separable data is perfectly separable okay maximize the margin okay what are the limitations what are the limitations cannot handle noise data or overlapping classes okay only works data is strictly linear separable it is sensitive to outliers for example i have discussed this is the some green class points these are the blue class points in this blue class area we are having some what is called as some another Uh, green class point so to in in this situation it is not possible to applying the hard margin hard margin let's coming back to <clears throat> this case okay so blue class points are fine from this we are finding this some blue class margin here we are having the more number of the green class points here only having single green class point by covering this if you are trying to find the margin we are having the huge difference between these two these two okay that's why this point we are called as outlier and this also may not give the better performance for example if you are removing this one let us assume if you are removing this point okay if you are removing this point we are getting the margin like this like this this is maximum margin at that time the model gives the better performance okay that is about this concept soft margin means okay so as all told in this case okay so it is impossible with hard margin why because in all in, in all the blue class points we are having one green class point that's why it is possible to apply the hard margin here what in soft margin what we can do is we are trying to violate some points for example i am instruct to the model i will instruct to the model and i am providing some data or i am given i am instruct to the model that means we may violate or we may avoid some of the points in the data set 
for example i can uh, instruct the model you may violate one green class point that is a misclassification point by considering one misclassification point then you have to uh, find out the margin okay that is called as a soft margin okay so for example if you are violating this green class point then you can easily get the hyperplane <coughs> with green class and some blue class margin and here i am giving the one condition that is you may violate one misclassification point or misclassification point okay so if if you are instead if you are instruct to the model violate some misclassification points then you have to find the margin such type of margin we are called as the soft margin we call this one soft margin that means it allows some misclassification or margin violations to handle noise or overlapping data so how we can find how we can given this value to the model with the parameter called as the c this parameter is called as some regularized parameter from this parameter we are passing some value of c what it can do is it violate some of the misclassification points by violating the some some misclassification points you are try, if you are you are trying to build a, a margin okay that is about the simple concept of uh, soft margin okay so the ultimate goal is maximize the combined object it maximizing the margin okay maximizing the margin reducing the misclassification penalty okay so that means we have to instruct to the model you may also violate some of the misclassification points the advantage is it works well for which one non linear separable data more flexible in real world applications okay so why because for example let assume you are having here we are having all the some blue color points okay so for example in some another uh, area we are having some red color points okay in red color points let us assume we are having one point like this here okay so if you are trying to build a margin to this point it may be it may be by seeing this one it may be some non linear data why because here some red points here some blue and red points if instead to the model you may violate one misclassification point you may violate some misclassification point and i am give some c equal to 1 let us assume so you can avoid one misclassification point that means i am avoiding this misclassification point simply i am not considering this point if i am not considering this point we can simply find the hyperplane with some maximal margin clear okay? that's why it many applications using the soft margin only in in lakhs of records if you consider 2 lakhs of records 1 lakhs of records okay maybe some points may two or two or three points may be in different classes okay so with, with the help of 100 point 1 lakh points we may having one point in some another class okay so by removing that single point out of the 1 lakh records that does not impact on the what is called as the model that's why in real world applications many of the uh, uh, machine learning um, engineers using the soft margin only okay main objective of uh, soft margin is we have to construct a margin that margin is having as large as possible okay so to get the margin as large as possible that will get by the parameter c if we take the higher c value that means we are getting the chance to fewer margin violations that means we are getting the narrow street if for example with some street okay if a smaller value of c we are getting the wider street that means more margin violations that means by taking the smaller value of c we are getting the higher margin hyperplane if we are taking the higher value of c we are getting the lower margin hyperplane okay so let's see some example here okay so here i am taking the value of c let's see we are getting some higher margin hyperplane that is wider hyperplane 
if you take the value of c we are getting the narrow margin hyperplane okay so even though we are having some misclassification okay that that is a main uh, pro, uh, advantage of what is called as uh, soft margin we are violating uh, some of the misclassification points after violating the misclassification points only we are trying to build the we have we, we are trying to construct the margin okay so better to choose the smaller value then we are getting the higher margin if you taking the more c value we are getting the lower margin so if you having the lower margin hyperplane then the model may not be a good if you having higher margin then we say that that model gives the good performance okay uh, let's see the differences between uh, hard margin and soft margin okay so as you know that hard margin mainly applied for linear linearly separable data whereas uh, soft margin is applied for overlapping and noise data overlapping means in some classes may be having some another class points so by the value of c we have to violate those overlapping points tolerance means no misclassification allowed that means all the points must be uh, separable only but allows some misclassification regularization here we are not applying any regularization here we are using the the parameter c as a regularization para parameter and practically it is limited use in real world cases but it was widely used in practical cases that means so many of the machine learning engineers using this what's called as the soft margin only while building the svm model that is about uh, hard margin and soft margin